just taste the Holy Spirit, you can interpret for me. Speak louder. Yeah. Then you can feel His peace coming to you and burdens go away. And the body feel comfort and, and light, even light. And and also you can feel the body swaying. The, the power of God coming upon us. Mm -hmm. Now, how does that help you? Now I interpret. No, I'm I'm not asking you to answer my question. Just interpret for me. How is that going to help you? Just interpret. Give Father Ishib Give Father Ishib You just interpret for me. I'm not asking you a question now. I'm sure she only had interpreted. Okay, what she said. So how does this help us spiritually? The point is, now we experience God's presence. Now this is just the beginning. Some people experience more and more joy. They could feel very happy. Now, let me ask you, did you feel some joy just now? Yeah. You did feel, it's like some happiness come out from the inside, right? Yeah. So, that's wonderful. That's what the Bible says that the fruit of the Holy Spirit is love, joy, peace. So, then we know God is present. God is not far away. And if you learn to pray with your spirit, your whole spirit pray to God. It's not just a mouth praying to God. The whole person love God. And then God's presence will come strong upon you every time you pray. And then when you are sad, God will take away the sadness. And when we don't have strength, God will give us strength. So that helps us all the time to know that God is with us. So that encourages us. And also when you pray more, and then you pray for each other, you find that you will also carry the power of God to bless other people. You pray for someone who is worrying, and they feel the worry goes away. Uh, you pray for someone unhappy, the sadness can go away, and sometimes you'll have joy. And they'll say, God is so close to me. So that way you can be used by God to bless people. So when you have this close relationship with God, and you seek to serve God by blessing other people, God's presence will stay with us. God will bless our whole life. Matthew 6.33 Seek ye first the kingdom of God and His righteousness and all these things will be added to you. Now we don't know about the future. But when we seek the kingdom of God and His righteousness that means we want to bring more people into the kingdom of God. We want to bring more people to follow Jesus. Also, we want Jesus to be our king in our hearts. Because where Jesus is the king, there is the kingdom of God. 
وين بكون انه ملك حياتنا بكون انه مملك يسوع يسوع We let Jesus be our king in our hearts. Then the, then the kingdom of God is in our heart. And then he will have a wonderful plan in our life. The wonderful plan of God will come true. God actually has a wonderful plan for each person or everyone. But when we don't follow God, we cannot enter this plan. But when we enter, we really follow God, then we enter this plan, then He has a wonderful plan for our life. We can be sure about our future. He will open the ways for us. Now, I want to ask you this question. She must go. Oh, okay. Now, so, now, so far what I've said to you, now tomorrow we can continue. Yeah. But what you see is that you can experience God. I just finish in two minutes and then let you go. Okay? Mm -hmm. Two minutes. So you can experience God. They, you saw that they experienced God also. So you know God is real. So you go home and spend more time praying. You experience his peace more when you go home. And then you know God is with you. He's not far away. And he will guide you for your future. That because when God protects you, there's nothing to worry about. Okay. Now, when you go home trying to, you know, stand up and love God, Lord Jesus, love Jesus, thank you, Jesus, and you can feel his peace coming to you. And then these few days, if you come every time, after these few days, your prayer will be totally different. And all your problems in life, God will help you one by one. Okay. Now, do you want to try to pray for just half a minute right now by self? You, you, you stand up now and pray to God for half a minute. Stand up. Stand up. See if you can feel the presence of God again. Close your eyes. Now, you all three try now. Mm -hmm.